Uh, hello, welcome back to part 16. We're riding the elevator up to see Mr. Dove. Man, it's rather marvelous, isn't it, Connor? Yeah. What the? What's wrong, my boy? Why are we going back up to see the tyrant? Why aren't we supposed to be running away from it? Well, well, we, we are going up to escape, but Mr. Tarrant follows us. Through I a hole. Oh, is. <laughs> Rawr. Look at me backside. It's my best side. Wow, he looks really cosy there. <laughs> ah. Persistent one, isn't Definitely. Okie dokie, let's now. do this. Shoot at his heart, he will block, but keep shooting, otherwise he'll whirl around and claw you what in is? the face. This fight is very fast and furious, it's over in a couple of minutes. Uh, either the death of you or the death of him. Like there, when, it, when he drops down, that's when you've successfully bossed him. But there are parts where he automatically hits you, but don't worry, there are plenty of herbs, or three to be exact, strewn around here, so don't worry. Two I'm right there. Exactly. It's Brad again! Why don't you use like your machine gun or something like that? You haven't even it. used it this part. I'm doing so well without it, I've already thirded. 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 Hardly third. Hardly even a quarter. Oh, You're lying. When he charges at you, get your shotgun ready, but only fire it at the last second. Too early, and he'll still hit you. And they play the quick time events like I didn't do. Uh, rocket launcher, feel free to use, but obviously you use it the best times, like when he's blocking his manky heart, then that's not a good time. But don't worry, when it comes down to the end of the fight, like the last smidge of it, come on. Whoa! As the as a new weapon will be deployed by Brad, the heavy rocket launcher. That's how you offer him in the actual game itself. Which is oh, good. So yeah. a bit of realism. Yep, so... Okie dokie, we're at uh, rocket launch ammo, down to our shotgun. I don't think I've got any machine gun, I don't think. Here we go, heavy rocket launcher. Or M MRL, is it? Alright, mounted rocket launcher. So go absolutely mental. There we go. And only in two minutes as well. 30 seconds of that, with an elevator. Wait, wait, wait. Do do do. It's not an easy fight, it's just a fast one. Wow, that helicopter yeah, cool. looks tiny. It looks like a little model one. Well, it did. Kaboom! Whoa. Kaboom. Why did it blow up? It's not the short sequence, you idiot. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Sorry, I thought it just kind of like... Fan service! Mm, let, let's see, what can we do to make this game slightly more interesting? Let's make a mansion blow up! Yeah! It's not drawn to a close for us just yet. Why is, Wesker, Chris, Chris, yet? Why is Wesker still the RPD stars of, like, narrating down. even though he's dead? The evidence of the event wow. Oh, is he not dead? He's just kind of like... For a brief moment, not dead? Felt the Wait, listen. Coming death. However, this too was part he of planned for him to be stabbed by the tyrant. But I had been reborn. I cast off my frail humanity and became some. A pair of great. glasses! My god. God, can you imagine that? B! Oh my god. Silence you. Stop my clear <laughs> on the files. I always fall behind on the files. I suck at finding files. We just yeah, well. the Wesker scenario. And in, uh, I think about part 19, 20, we'll be finding out what actually happened to Wesker. Yes, yes, yes. But for now, we're going to play through Rebecca's sub-scenario. And she's got two levels of it. Yeah. We've got a new weapon, the... Mounted rocket launcher. Oh, it's uh, a high-power... Submachine gun. Oh, a high power. Oh, yeah. That's... It's better, though. It's time. I rate it slightly slower. I went to the mansion where Bravo team was to rendezvous. I like rendezvous. It's one of my favorite words. 
I found that none of the don't know why. Were there. Tea collection. I like rendezvous. I like bubos. I like guff. Oh my god, she's I'm floating. floating. With pictures, lots of scary pictures, and a lamp! Ah, oh, and a snake, which is kind of fair enough to be honest. What snake? Oh, yeah. Ooh. I'm sorry, you had a bad doorway kind of thing. You had a, obviously had a bad, um, experience with a snake when you were younger, so you involuntarily do not see them anymore. No, you're just crazy and you see snakes when there aren't any. However, I did have horrible childhood okay? experiences with geets and ghosts. Geets? Geese! Pizza! Geets. Yeah, geets. Pizza. 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 Oh, we're fighting some monster. We're fighting some monster? Don't call it some monster, it's a good monster. Give it its title. I see. It's Richard Aiken. I have a foppish hairdo. <laughs> <laughs> Big ears. Got attacked by those things. Wow, he them. has a ridge in his hairdo. That's really strange. Uh, Do you know who else has foppish hair? Who? Hugh Grant. To find Enrico. Yay. Yay. Yay, hey, Hugh Grant. My dad said that he once imagining uh, once imagined time. punching Hugh Grant in the stomach and said that it'd be funny because when you first, think about it, his hair would all flop forward. That's lovely. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't um, like it. He thinks that it like I think he I think he thinks that it's one of those he's one of those people that make that like emphasizes everything bad about the British. Everything annoying about the British. Okay. So like he gives like examples to Americans so they kinda go, Hey, do you like the Queen? Do you like having a tea party with the Queen? Oh hell? no! Bees! My god, they're large bees. My That's god. really good knife work. <laughs> bees! They're so scary! Yeah, so whereabouts are we now? Are we still in the mansion or...? Bang. Well, um... You know where we left off with Rebecca? Yes. Basically resume from there. So the mansion still stands. Cause Jump back in time a bit. It's basically, uh, you know, we saw Rebecca around the mansion, Resident Evil One, a lot. It, it's yes, it's showing every single thing that she did. Right. For the hills, okay. it's a case of zombie moves. Oh my god! Isn't that great? That's disgusting. You. <laughs> Die, you! You horrible person! Shoot him in the move. That'll kill him quicker. <laughs> well, with the death of Zombie Move Man, we'll yeah, we'll see in part 17. So please join us then. Goodbye.